Okay, so today is going to be a serious discussion. Mainly about my truth. Today, I want to expose myself in order to move on with my life. Ever since last year, or after a big event called, known as, I guess we'll call it the breakup, it really caused me to change or become someone different. It made me think that I have to do or be someone else in order to be happy. And today I'm going to expose all my lies. This whole year, I can say, has had both many ups and downs. Especially in school. Friendships and ideas. I'm not going to say any bullshit and just be straight up honest with everyone. Yes, ever since last year, I always said so many things. I always wanted to be someone else. And I did. For periods of time. And in the end, I became delusional. Delusional in how I act. Delusional in how I think. And delusional in how I feel. The reason why I'm creating this right now is because I can't go on anymore. If I go on, I mean, I can't go on with these lies anymore. There was this sentiment the moment I decided to open my mouth and say so much stuff. And that was, fake it till you make it. And that sentiment that I've had has been with me ever since the first time I spoke a lie this year. And that was in around mid-February when I hung out with people at the library. That was the first part. And what was that? That was the amount of figures I made with the online stores. In reality, I've made zero dollars with the online stores and some of them aren't even operational anymore and yet i continue to say i will do it i i always said each and every day between those months of february all the way up to about may Every time I say something, I will put it as a chip on my shoulder to show everyone that I can do it. And in reality, I haven't. And for me, it's gotten to the point where it just hurts a lot and I'm just tired of my bullshit. Like, especially today. Today, I after school, I spent time with... Uh, with a girl and we talked for a while. I guess people can call it a date or whatever but to be honest we just hung out. And for me, I really don't know who I am and how I want to be perceived by her or just by people in general. And it really hurt me to like, after we left that I'm like stuck in between and don't know what I want to do. <laughs> this is going to be a very emotional video for me because I want to expose myself. I said I would expose myself at the end of the year but in order to be happy now and to do my very best, I will 
expose myself right now. Yes, I have other Instagram accounts. But are their followings massive? No. What have I taught my friend about Instagram was what I learned from other people. Although yes, I did grow it, grow them for a bit, and every so often, but I never fully executed. Some of my fr one of my friends also has this idea that I work like every day. And yes, that's true, but the work that I've done hasn't been meaningful. It hasn't produced the results that I want, or it's very minor and I'll just indulge in personal services or not personal services, but procrastination. My friends in July, the talk in July really brought this sentiment out because I just straight up lied to them again, even though they knew exactly. In my mind, I do really want to self-improve. But some of my goals and ideas that I've set for myself are ones that I don't actually want to achieve. They instead hurt me a lot and have caused me to become this sort of fake version of myself and I really don't like it. Because of this fake version of myself, I haven't been able to interact with everyone the way I want to because I've set up restrictions, limitations, or beliefs about myself. I also don't know if I do anything that makes me happy anymore. Except lately, ever since I started calling this person or talking to someone after school, it started to remind me about who I was and what I enjoy and when I hung out with that person today it reminded me even more even when I was eating dinner today I felt my stomach or gut just pulling me to just record and create this because I know that if I'm unable to expose myself now I wouldn't, and I'd just be living my life as a lie. I guess this year I've disappointed myself and my parents the most, although they don't know yet because I've hid most of the things about school. And although, yes, I did improve in some areas of my studies, I've dropped in others. Listening to uh, the podcast that I'll display like here about two times after school or after seeing her or meeting with her caused me to really think what the hell am I doing with my time? What am I doing with my life? What am I doing not being authentic? I know this video is going to get a lot of criticism and I'm willing to accept it because the only thing I can say is I'm sorry. And I hope now that <clears throat> I've expressed myself that you guys are able to forgive me. I also hope that I can move forward with my life and just be who I want to be and not create this false JC in my mind. <laughs> so, all of my goals in terms of economics and 
finance will all be halted for a bit. Well, we'll just stop for now. Because what I really want to do right now is just study and find out what makes me happy. Yeah, I'm going to end it here and once again I just hope everyone continues to watch. Uh, thanks.